Welcome back, Digidestin. Did you hear? Bring more bets. And we're back to the Pendulum Z's, guys. Uh, so this is going to be a third run of the Pendulum Z's. Uh, make sure you check out my other videos if you haven't seen them before. But uh, as of last time, I put them all on freeze. So they're being frozen right now. We're going to unfreeze them, and then we're going to back them up and start new eggs. So here we go. Uh, frozen mode. Let's go here. Um, and it's back. The Huang Long Mon. Pokemon and our Anubimon. Sad Anubimon. It's still sad Anubimon didn't make it to Super Mega or Super Ultimate, but that's fine. We'll get it next time. Alright, uh, so they're pretty much all done right now. Like I said last time, that one failed that Super Mega Evolution. And those two did get it, but we're going to save them for next time in case we want to battle somebody if there's somebody which is not really anybody close by there's maybe there's like one person <laughs> in the whole area <laughs> all right so um so what we're gonna do is go down to this book right here yep move this out of the way for now we'll go back to it later uh, it's been a while since i've done this so camera correctly Like the slot, slot B, because that was only our second run. So, time. Alright, now they're all ready to go. One, two, three. Alright, they're being backed up into their memory cards, and now we have three eggs. It takes about a minute to hatch. Uh, so I'll update you guys a little bit on this. I know I wasn't gonna go too much in detail because I probably make I'm gonna make another video sometime later to kind of just go review about the device. But there's some stuff I found out just right after making the last video. So I'll go over that uh, once we hatch these eggs and once we get started. So it's gonna take a minute again, like I said, to hatch these eggs. Uh, then it's gonna take 10 minutes from then to change from the baby one form to the baby two form, and then it'll take uh, what is it? I think 12 hours, 12 hours to get to uh, the rookie form. Um, as I said in my other videos, I like to do this at night more, to start these eggs at night, because then I don't have to watch them all day as a baby, even though they're pretty cute. It's just that they're a little bit more needy as a babies, and then, yeah, you just don't, you don't, you just don't have to deal with it if you do it at night, because the uh, sleep time is counted. So, uh, yeah, sleep time is counted, so that's really nice. Now we got our babies again. Uh, I'll start this one. Be quick. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, four. So, uh, this one over here is Algomon. Uh, oh, no wrong one. This is Algomon. Uh, we've seen it in the anime before, and it's just a, kind of a, looks like a, just an eyeball slime kind of thing. Um, not much to it. We've seen this in the past few videos. Uh, it's already at max level, so it's not like you can do much right now. I don't think you can battle right now. And then on this one, we have... Tsubumon, I think. Yep, Tsubumon. Uh, kind of a cute little puffball, I guess. <laughs> um, and on the green one, the Nature Spirits, we have classic Bodomon. So it's going to take 10 minutes for those to, to go on. Uh, let's see, roughly time. Oops. So, yeah. So it's just about 6, so it's going to be 6 10 ish. Alright, so I'll uh, push those aside for now. Alright. So, uh, this is actually pretty fun, more fun than I thought it would be on the Digivice uh, 2020. Uh, so, I realized they're kind of 
four buttons, three kind of four, three-ish kind of buttons. So we have the A button over here, which, you know, A button to select something, the B button to cancel, also skip animations for stuff. And then we have this button over here, which is kind of two, there's one up here and one down here. Uh, this scrolls, one of them scrolls up and one scrolls down, basically. Uh, so, so in the status mode, oh, let me clean it real quick. Uh, poop clean up. Alright, so, um, here's the status bar again. Uh, I, I've, I haven't played too much, but I played enough where I got another Digimon that joined our crew. Um, Biomon. And yeah, still a Gabumon. So, uh, this is really based a lot. Quest mode is really based off of the show. Uh, and just like the show, the first area, we only had Agumon, Gabumon. And like to my surprise, you had you can access uh, Omegamon at the final boss already, which is uh, kind of cool, but it's also kind of like whoa, isn't that kind of fast? But still very cool. Oh, going back to the settings here, uh, this is the light. You can turn the lights and the lights off, just like you can turn the sounds off too, because so you can preserve a little bit of the battery. But we're just gonna keep it on. Um, here again, the quest mode uh, for A or one. Scroll up or which backwards technically right now and scroll continue on more is down cancel is this one on the side um, go back in there you can select the area two or the other areas that we have on them unlocked um, a few things I'm gonna I'll break this down again in my review video but uh, one thing that I kind of don't like about this one is that there's only one speaker here uh, so if your hand like usually I hold it like this or hold like this you're covering up the sound a little bit. I mean, it is very loud, but I'm doing it at home. I'm just kind of by myself. So I like, I would like to hear it more. It's just that like, if I'm blocking it, it kind of muffles the sound a little bit. Kind of a little bit of minor inconvenience, but not game breaker, but just saying, just putting it out there for you guys. Um, I can walk with uh, anybody that I have right now if I wanted to. So if I want to switch to Biomon, I just keep going here okay, again, so I keep going and yeah. And now it's there. Uh, also, I realized there's no like DP energy bar, and it's all very based on the anime. <laughs> like very, very based on the anime. Like it's more convenient to fall, it's more convenient for them to make it go along the anime lines. So, like I said, in the first boss area, of the, the first area, you got to Omega Mon because that's how the story went. Um, you didn't have to use Omega Mon to win. It just, it just makes it a whole lot easier. <laughs> Um, so let me show you that if I can get it quick. Uh, so we're gonna go to the quest mode. Yeah. Right. It's pretty cool. There we go. Algamon Mega Level. I like that. The animations are pretty cool, I think. Alright, uh, we're gonna select to use. Uh, Agumon. Sorry about that. Uh, Alright, so. Uh, here we just battle. The second option is Shinka. That's evolution. Now, normally we could go to Greymon, but if we keep going... Oh, we can't do it now. Hmm. Guess not. That might have been the for one time only. So I guess when you go replay it, you can't do it. Because the first time I did it, it let me do it. And I guess I beat it, so I can't go back now. Um, so yeah. This is what happens when you battle. It's pretty cool. Or you, you evolution. Go hit evolution. And it's asking if we want to use item. We don't want. We don't want to. All right. As you level up, that that the the roulette thing gets faster and faster. doing so hot right now. Ooh, that was just one fireball. It took so much damage. Noble Blast. 
Okay, that took a lot of damage. Yep, good, good. Nice dodge. Don't fire. Okay, we just need to hit it one more time. I love that tune. This one especially. Okay, so. Uh, that's just one of the boss battles. Uh, let's clean up the poop here quick. I don't know if you can hear it, but this thing is significantly more louder than these ones are. <laughs> like, way, way louder. Um, this is really cool though. Uh, the sprite is way bigger too, if you can see that. Check out this big ass sprite compared to that little one right there. I don't know if it's a good comparison to see, but yeah, way bigger sprite. Um, wish we had bigger sprites and wish we had color V-Pets by now, but you know, we don't. <laughs> um, so that's pretty much it. I've been playing them slowly. Uh, this one, like the evolutions, they're based on how many battles you've done. Uh, and even if you lose, it doesn't matter. They don't get sick. They don't, you don't need to feed them or anything, because this is just a quest-based device. And now it's sleeping. It's not even a pedometer inside. Whereas these ones, we do have to keep track of them. Uh, of course, you can't really fail it right now. It's pretty hard to. One, two, they're babies, but still. I mean, they only last like 10 minutes. <laughs> these ones only last like 10 minutes, so it doesn't take too long, as long as you're watching it. Don't forget it completely. about three minutes to go or right now actually oh, perfect timing though so that one's lagging a little bit uh, this is Wanyaman it's a cute little kind of tiger striped uh, furry like wolf I want to say it's a wolf kind of thing uh, baby two training baby two or in training two uh, this is Upaman I think this is the natural in, in training or baby version of uh, Armadillomon. And we got the second form of Algomon, just, which is just a bigger blob. <laughs> uh, also again in the anime. So um, this one, uh, so just checking, I, I don't know when Humulus finished it or updated it, but he has updated uh, his uh, hatchery site now. So they're mostly all filled in. I didn't check everything, but uh, mostly all filled in. Even if the, li the line, the actual physical the line on the screen doesn't show it, but you can actually, if you click on them, you can actually see uh, evolution requirements. So uh, thank you to Humulus for updating your site and collecting all their information. Uh, so now, this time we're actually gonna follow the guide. I think I'm gonna go for some of the O2 Digimon, O2 starters. So we, or this one, I'm, I think uh, we're gonna go for Armadillomon on this one. Uh, this one, I think we're gonna go for Salomon or Plotmon. And this one, I think we're gonna go for Wormon. I uh, believe they all require at least one, one, one to three, or one to two effort hearts, and they all require at least two camera stakes. I probably should have fed them just now. But uh, yeah, so I gave myself some time. Started this at six, roughly 6 p.m. I got a little bit of time before they go to sleep at nine. I think it's nine. And then they'll be ready to go by tomorrow, by before I even wake up, because they'll digivolve with me, like I said, 12 hours. So about 6.07 in the morning, they should digivolve into their next baby forms and hopefully digivolve into the correct forms. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, you guys have seen those before. Not much else going on. I'm just going to let them get the care mistakes. To get care mistakes, uh, some of the best ways to do it is just let them starve. Uh, when you let them both starve, both like hearts deplete completely. Uh, these ones right here. So when you let these hearts, the, the hunger, and the strength, if they both deplete at the same time and the call light goes out, uh, that's two That's two care mistakes. Uh, so then you'll be good after that. 
So I just need to do that once and I'll be good. Otherwise, another way to rack up camera stick intentionally, uh, like really intentionally, is to change the clock to when about past their bedtime and then uh, the, then they'll get a call light saying they want to go to sleep and turn the lights off, please. Uh, then you just got to ignore that. And then after you ignore that and the light goes out, boom, you got your camera mistake. So um, that's it for today, guys. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, support me by hitting that like button. Uh, any, any likes and all likes help. Um, also support me for free by hitting subscribe and hit ring that notification bell. Uh, and as always, don't forget to feed your digital pets. Peace.